Hello, let us stay old and the new in the gospel of today and in our spiritual life and why we shouldn't mix the two types of our spiritual life at once in one period of time because they somewhat exclude themselves so let's start with the old way the old way of um, approaching spirituality is that we have the fixed ways of um, for instance we have fixed um, number of our prayers that we are observing during the day the fixed number of fasting time and this is helpful for many of us this is not a bad way of spirituality or uh, something which doesn't have value yes it has because it permits us to and give us the security there will be a time during the day where i will have my time of focus of concentration of something and there will be time in the during the year where i will fast and this is a good way of thinking but why it, it's not and good to mix it with what Jesus is introducing. Jesus is introducing a new way. This is the full attention of every moment in our life. That is the disciples are following Jesus and then spontaneously there are some fasting time because uh, let's say you don't have enough food at one day and so you are fastening because you are walking from one village to another and there is not sufficient to, to, uh, to eat. And there are times which official fastening times, but you are with other people and you have to be open for them and to communicate with them, to eat together, to create a communion. And this is not matching with this, with this fasting time that you are observing. So I think that Jesus is saying you don't have to mix them too. You have if you are more in the period of life where you have to don't have and you don't need this fixed structure because you are in the communion with God you feel that and you can respond on every moment of our, your life to to what you are hearing you are feeling and you pay attention so Maybe one day you will pray for longer time, other day for shorter time. Maybe you will be in the steady connection during whole day. But there are times when you will need the structure, where only the structure will be helpful for you because you can share, for instance, your fasting time with other people. You can share your praying time with other people. And so it will be important for you. So I think the gospel is presenting us two approaches and on the saying that this is not something which we can do in one and the same time. Thank you.